Rowing is a repetitive motion, it's simple, but to do it well is actually very difficult, <laughs> despite what it looks like. The alarm goes off at 5.10, which gives me 50 minutes to get my boat on the water um, for a 6 a.m. launch. I've probably seen more sunrises now than most people see in their life, and it's totally worth it. After being cut from the Beijing team, I felt like I had failed, but I realized I really still had the itch to keep rowing. I wanted to see how fast I could go. There are about 270 strokes. I like to count most of those strokes in tens. The 10 strokes seems to be this number where I can convince myself to work just a little bit harder because 10 strokes is such a manageable number. So it's about getting it all out for those 10 and then maybe I'll have two strokes without counting and then go right back to counting another 10. Four. I am the fastest woman in the country in a single. Last year I had two podium appearances at the World Cups. I was fourth at the World Championships. There's nothing like being fourth to motivate you to get on that podium. When I'm in the single and the water is flat, I'm in the zone, it feels like I'm flying. Even though it hurts like hell, you have to do everything you can to convince yourself that you have to push even harder. When the race begins, it's the moment in which I feel most alive. It goes from total stillness to total exertion and chaos almost in a split second. The harder I push, the faster I'm going to go. And I want to win.